gyroscope. The game to send you spinning off your head. Attempt to guide a fast and furiously gyrating gyroscope across 20 separate screens. Make the most of your seven lives in this unique arcade strategy challenge. But we have to tell you, it's not easy. Steep slopes, slippery glass, directional magnets, aliens and narrow ledges are among the many obstacles you'll find in this amazing 3D scenario. High resolution graphics and superb synthesizer music combine to create the atmosphere of this compulsively addictive game. Eight ninety five on the Commodore, BBC B and Amstrad. And only seven ninety five on Spectrum. At last, the moment Amstrad owners have been waiting for. Virgin's follow-up to the superb sorcery. Your lonely mission is to visit this massive 250-roomed factory orbiting in the vast wastes of space. This is arcade adventuring at its peak. For Amstrad computers at 885, also are available for Commodore 64 and Spectrum. Big League Soccer, the definitive football strategy game for your Amstrad. Wheel and deal and manage your team to the top. First, let's take a look at the league table. And we're third from the top in the fourth division. Let's see who we're playing next. And the draw's not a good one. Tranmere Rovers, and away. Let's pick our team. Are our ratings good enough? Or do we need to make further changes? Just a draw should move us up. We're already one down. Oh no, it's another goal. Two down. And it's all over. And not only have we lost the match, but we've lost over 3,000 pounds as well. Let's see how the other managers have done. Let's buy a new player. Who's available? Let's put an offer in for Barnes. And we've been successful. Now we'll win. Amstrad Action and their rave review say you'll be playing it until the early hours. Available here on cassette for the Amstrad at only six ninety-five. Areola Soft proudly present their first Spectrum dedicated release. Panzer Drone, a program of senseless destruction for your Spectrum 48K. The Panzer Drone is an island inhabited by robot tanks of varying levels of intelligence and viciousness. With over 200 enemy tanks, supplies of mines, mortars, and polycrete, mega turrets, and a totally wreckable panzerchrome landscape. Panzer drone will simply blow your mind. Your mission is to build a super tank and annihilate the island completely. Panzer drone out now from Areola Soft. Ariolersoft bring you their number one Commodore hit, Sky Fox, the action-packed combat simulation, available now on cassette for the Amstrad and Spectrum. Both versions retain all the features that have made it such a smash hit on the Commodore. These include 15 different combat scenarios from training mission to massive onslaught, 3D scrolling flight simulation, air-to-ground and air-to-air -air battles in the same game. Use the base computer to plan your offensive. Stand by for takeoff with the autopilot feature for launch and enemy searches. With its incredible speed and agility, the Sky Fox is a machine that you'll have to fly to believe. Annihilate the invader with deadly laser cannons. Destroy the enemy aircraft using heat-seeking and radar-guided missiles. But remember that the only thing that stands between the enemy and the destruction of the home base is you and the Sky Fox.
Sky Fox, the number one hit from Ariolasoft. Get your copy now. Lou from Quicksilver. Yabba dabba doo. Fred Flintstone, that lovable hero, has been promoted from Stone Age to Computer Age. Help Fred build his house from a pile of boulders around Bedrock. Only when he's completed his house can he expect to ooh the delectable Wilma. The woman of his dreams is heavily into property, and until Fred gets his building act together, marital bliss will continue to escape him. So it's an easy task. But there are dinosaurs, flying pterodactyls, and a manic tortoise all out to hinder him. Fred's energy level is constantly being eaten away. Only seeing Wilma can restore his stamina. So, it's back to the rock quarry to get that house built. Watch that pterodactyl too late. Energy level getting low, Fred. Let's try to find Wilma. She must be here somewhere. There she is, Fred. Take her home. Yabba yabba doo! On Commodore Electro and Amstrad at 795. Mirasoft invites you to become a Fleet Street Editor. The graphics library give you 200k of ready-to-use illustrations which you can take to the studio, change them around, or create your own. Then it's off to the copy desk to add headlines and copy. You can use WordWise or View. Now you're ready to put your panels together and make a page. You can preview your page and print in high quality standard or condensed mode with or without a center rule. And the administration department where you configure the program for your system, fast forward disks and transfer external files. Personal publishing on the BBC. Two disks, manual and money off vouchers. Just $39.95. Also from Firebird's hut range is the hysterical Jerry the Germ Goes Body Popping. You're going to need an awful lot more than just bleach and an old wire brush to deal with a real streetwise germ like Jerry. Unfortunately, Jerry got himself thrown out of the Institute of Infectology for failing to obtain his stink plumber. Now he's really got to prove himself before he'll be allowed in society of germ kind. Jerry's already chosen an unsuspecting victim for his purposes. He'll have to work his way up through the body, inflicting as much damage as he possibly can wherever he goes until he finally reaches his destination, the heart, where he must cause a massive coronary. Do you think we're kidding? Buy Jerry the Germ for your Spectrum Commodore or Amstrad at $7.95 and see for yourself. Quake minus one. The all action game from Monolith Beyond. This is your battleground. A giant undersea complex. Your weapons are fast, deadly mobiles. Your weapons pack a powerful punch. So do your opponents. Destroy the enemy before they destroy you. Quake Minus One is now available for your Commodore 64 and 128.